Hello and welcome to the Eagles Table. I'm Abby J. and I'm so happy to be here today to share with you my summer ambrosia. I just got back from Ingalls, so let's get started. First of all, the summertime is when we have just such a bounty of fruit and I love making this. Ambrosia is normally a heavier dish. It's got whipped cream and sour cream and it's normally made at Thanksgiving and Christmas, but I've done a different twist on this. It's a lighter version. So I'm gonna take these fresh blackberries, about a cup of those. We've got some raspberries. It's real colorful, the fruit's colorful, and it just makes a really pretty dessert. And I've got a lot of different um, ways of showing how you do this. So I put in the blackberries, the blueberries, the strawberries, and I've cut one nectarine, got that. And what I'm gonna do, instead of the sour cream and the whipped cream, I've got one, about, not one cup, but about three tablespoons of uh, honey. This is sour wood honey. And I'm going to also cut one lime. We're gonna put some lime over this. The lime will keep the fruit from getting brown. If you're serving it in the hot summertime, you've gotta have either lime or lemon on your fruit. And this helps prevent it from uh, turning brown so your fruit will look real pretty. And there, we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna incorporate these flavors like so together. So then what we're going to do is incorporate about a cup and a half of marshmallows and that gives it that pop. And then we're going to take about one tablespoon of fresh mint, stir that in together and now after we incorporate that I have frozen a real uh, stainless steel martini glass and the reason I did this is because it keeps it cold and I love to serve this to my guests and it, it, I'm gonna right now show you how I do this just fill this full make sure we get all the different berries in there we're going to these blackberries are so nice in the summertime they're so big this year we're going to finish it off with some toasted coconut. And that's one way you can serve it. There's another way, I have parties, and you know, uh, if you want to really take a shortcut and make it simple, uh, a, a simple dessert for guests, you just go buy your local Ingles and get uh, this key lime pie. You can use lemon pie as well. And this also makes a real beautiful presentation. And if you're looking for a fun way to get your kids involved, we'll put this one right over here. I like that. That's so pretty. If you're looking for something to get your kids involved, you want to get the little waffle cones and fill this right up. And that's a really good way for your kids to eat real healthy. And, and it gives them uh, something to do fun in the summertime. And if they don't like the waffle cone, there's a little cup where you can present this like in one of the plates and we can just put this in the little cup. This makes it non-messy. This is non-messy. So I really enjoy making this and all these different ways because it really is a fun way to eat lighter, healthier for the summertime. And there you have it. Thanks for joining me here at the Ingalls Table. Make sure you check out the website for more recipes, tricks, and tips. We'll see you next time and happy summer.